Good evening, everybody, and thanks for joining us. I'm Sean Mooney. Several Tucson dog owners who are desperately searching for their missing dogs are convinced they've been stolen and believe it's part of a coordinated effort to profit from people's missing pets. News for Tucson's Chorus Nylander is live in Midtown with more on their search efforts. Chorus. Yeah, well, Sean, this is a sign here for a dog named Percy that's been missing for five months now. Her owner hasn't given up hope, spending a lot of money and a lot of time trying to find her, but her search efforts have made her convinced that her dog was stolen and sold as part of some sort of ring of pet thieves, and she's not the only one. It's a case that would be cold if not for the determination of Percy's owner, Kathleen Cover, who is desperately trying to find out where her precious Belgian Shepherd could be. We've had Percy for 10 years, um, her whole life, and um, she's just, I mean, she's part of our family. Like, there's a huge hole in our family. Kathleen says Percy slipped out of a suspiciously open back gate. We believe that someone opened the gate and let her out. They began putting up flyers and searching all over, even hired a pet detective. She says they got several interesting leads, but still unable to locate Percy. As she began to lose hope, she then received a tip that caught her interest here at the QT on Valencia and Interstate 19. And they were, they're positive that Percy was transferred from a woman to a couple. Uh, in the parking lot. Kathleen says she went to the QT. A staff member let her see surveillance video that she believes captured sight of Percy. She was not provided the video, and News 4 Tucson has not seen it to verify it. We think it's a pretty good lead. We filed a police report. Uh, unfortunately, QT won't hand the video over to us. Tucson police confirmed she filed a report online, but said currently they are not investigating. Kathleen believes Percy is the victim of a larger operation involving stolen dogs. Dogs are being taken from people's houses and yards, and it, it, it's got to stop. Bob Hines has been searching for his missing dog, Walter, for three weeks now. We're just distraught. He's part of the family, and we just don't know where he is. Bob says a man found Walter and was trying to return him, but was convinced by a woman who claimed to have animal shelter experience that she could take care of the dog and was better suited to find its owner. That man believed her, but then contacted Bob after seeing the posters. The description of the woman, he says, sounds just like the woman Kathleen saw in the video. If she was legit, she would have found us. It seems to be that there is actually something going on here in Tucson where somebody is actually taking or stealing dogs. What they're doing with them is you know, hopefully what we can find out and hopefully get some dogs back to people. Now, the Tucson Police Department tells us they have received no concerning number of stolen pet reports and are not aware of any sort of organized effort to steal people's pets. We have more information. If you know anything about Walter or, Walter or Percy, we have information on who you should contact over on our website, kboa.com. There's a $2,000 reward now being offered for information that leads to the return of Percy. We're live from the west side, Corus Nylander, News 4 Tucson.